The following content is brought to you by CGChaco.com, a website mostly specialized in the creation of 3D lighting tools for 3D artists and 3D freelancers. Whatever the 3D project, lighting is crucial to ensure a successful final rendering. For more information, please visit www.CGChaco.com and discover our unique and innovative tools. Hello, today I'm going to show you how to create a simple lighting setup to simulate external night lighting. I'm not going to do a step-by-step -step tutorial, I find it more practical to explain an existing scene this time. So you have a global view of the concept from the beginning of the video. The scene is very simple, it consists of a statue, a floor plan and another plan for the wall. Before starting any project that requires realistic lighting with Blender, make sure you respect the real size of each object on the stage. Light behaves according to the size of the objects and can be wrong depending on the desired result. The statue here measures 2 meters to simulate an approximation to human size. You can see its dimensions by selecting it and clicking the tab named Item. In this environment you can see three light sources. They are three sunlight objects but the first one is transformed into moon and the second one into low intensity sun and the last one is transformed into backlight. For the moon I just changed the intensity to 2.6, changed the color to light blue and changed the angle of inclination to match the time of night I want to simulate. For the sun I wanted to simulate a very subtle sunset so I changed the light intensity to 0.2 and the color to orange. This sunset effect adds realism to the scene but also adds dynamism in the colors and the general contrast of the scene. The third source is transformed into a backlight that points towards the back of the statue to enhance the contours of the object. To have a subtle effect I deactivated the shadow, decreased the intensity to 1 and I also changed the color to a desaturated dark blue. The positions of the sun and the moon are not important but the orientation is. In this scene the moon is pointing down as in reality. To do this you can rotate the moon with respect to the y-axis. The sun is pointing at a flat angle to simulate the sunset. That's it. It's quite simple. Once your lighting is installed you can add other elements to the scene or manipulate the ones already there. Thank you for watching the video and subscribe to be notified when I post new videos.